It began many years ago with one of our uh, PTA parents who thought it would be a good idea to get the children involved and, and have a little more community awareness. And um, it's just got grown over the years. For the last 11 years we've been doing it and the whole school is involved. We start off with a kickoff assembly and we have a smart board presentation with different statistics and information and we also take the children's pictures when they come in and bring food and we put that in a slideshow and the children just love seeing themselves in, in the slideshow. And everybody just gets involved. We have the kindergarten does, they graph, they bring their cans in, they graph. The upper grades look at the cans and we look for nutrition information. We look at how many people each can can feed. And we just try to promote it. We, we feel that education is more than just passing tests. We want the children to be more aware of their community and helping others. So now this event is the stuff a truck, so what, what are we doing today? Well today we have people, the, the kids and their families are coming and they're stopping by with bags of food and we've got their barrels are filling up and we're taking pictures for next year's slideshow and hoping to fill the truck. Excellent. And, how, and you said how many years? Is Eleven years we've been doing it. It was started by a parent. A parent originally started it and of course the, the child is no longer with us and we've just continued doing it, you know, and we just think it's a really great cause. And you guys, do you work directly with uh, the Long Island Parents Heritage Foundation? Yes, yes, and that's also part of our Smart Board presentation. Uh, we give the whole history of Long Island Cares. We have Harry Chapin, we talk about him and, and, and what his vision was. How long do you guys... Well, we we run it throughout the whole week. So children bring in cans if they you know if they're unable to come today, they bring in cans all week. And if they come today, we're here from nine to twelve. So, Excellent. and they come from their sports events. We've had children coming from from dance class. So we've had children in tutus. We've had children in soccer uniforms from their baseball games, and they bring their pets. Uh, so it's it's really like a community. Of, I, I was going to say, I've been noticing a few of the four-legged children. Yes, yes, we have some. We have some uh, little pets here, and uh, a lot of teachers are here today. And, and were you aware that the, uh, the food drive also uh, raises gets pet food for people in need? I, I think we're going to have to start promoting that, especially since we have so many pets showing up for this food drive. So. Yep. A pet food, right. And I, I also know there's a program for school supplies. A lot of Girl Scouts uh, sometimes put boxes in the main lobby and we donate to that too. So. Absolutely. So right. we, we really feel Long Island Cares is, is a really good cause. Wonderful. Thank you very much. Okay. Thank you.